Hey you guys, Young Hollywood is here sitting down with Army Hammer. We're gonna give you the inside scoop on his new film, Final Portrait. Alberto Giacometti, one of the most accomplished and respected artists of his generation, asked me to sit for a portrait. I've got the flight the next day is the only thing. That's fun. It gives us enough time? Yes. I'm so excited to be sitting down with you because you've got this new movie, Final Portrait, which is crazy because everyone's still talking about Call Me By Your Name and you already have a new movie coming out. It's weird to be back doing interviews. We just finished sort of this crazy Academy campaign for Call Me By Your Name and I remember waking up the day after the Academy Awards and just being like, oh, thank God, that's all done. Wait, we have another one of these to do? I watched the trailer and it looks very interesting. What drew you to this? When you got the script, what made you want to do this movie? I liked the idea that Stanley Tucci was directing another movie. I think he's an amazing actor and I think he's a phenomenal director. Big Night's one of my favorite movies. And I got to make a movie where I got to sit completely still for most of it, so it sounded like an easy shooting process. Yeah, you didn't want to do the dancing anymore. You already just sit in a chair. I already for did the dancing, that's done. Yeah. What was it like working with, with Stanley Tucci? He seems like such a quirky, fun guy to work with. He's great. My favorite thing about Stanley Tucci is he's just a class act. I mean, he's a great director, he's a great actor, and it's always nice to be directed by an actor because they know how actors like and need to be spoken to in order to get the desired outcome. Oh. But also, at the end of every day, Stanley's assistant Lottie would come down with a tray of martinis and he would she would come into set and she would give one to Stanley and one to Jeffrey and one to me and we would sit on set talking about the day talking about everything we did and we would drink a martini and we'd finish our martini and Stanley would go all right where are we dining tonight? And then we would go home and shower and do all that stuff. And then we would go and have a phenomenal meal together at the end of the day. Oh my it gosh, was awesome. are directors normally like that? Just give no. me martinis after No. A day? By the way, <laughs> like I now think every director should give out martinis. That's just the way it goes. That is so Especially nice. for breakfast. And what's it like too working with, with Jeffrey Rush? It was great. It was great. I play a character who just watches Alberto Giacometti do his thing, and it made my job really easy because I just got to sit and watch Jeffrey Rush do his thing. He's a phenomenal actor. He's he's one of the greats and getting to watch him completely transform himself into Giacometti made my job a lot easier. Would you ever get your own portrait done in real life like that? Like get your portrait painted? No, even when someone tries to take a selfie with me, it takes too long. When they're like, hi, nice to meet you, can I get a selfie? And you're like, yeah, sure. And they pull out their phone and they open the camera and it's facing the wrong way. And you're like, oh God, pick it up. And then they're like, okay, let me, hold on, let me turn it around. Do you know how to turn around? Okay, let me turn it around. Okay, can we get a picture? Wait, let me get one more. And you're just like, okay, this is already oh. taking too long. They sat for 17, 19 days or whatever to paint this thing. I don't have that kind of attention span. Yeah, do you just prefer to take the selfie yourself? like take someone's phone and just do it yourself because you can do it that. faster. I've done that, just like, g g g just <laughs> give me that. Yeah, just, I, I can basically. do it, okay, I'm yeah. a professional now. Yeah. So no self-portraits, so then what do you like to do for fun when you're not acting? I like to cook, I like to cook for my family, I like to hang out with my friends, I like to, I feel like it's like a dating thing. You know, I like to I like to cook, I like to hang out with my friends, I like to go to the movies, I like to read. Yeah. You should be the next Bachelor, that's great. This you like is to it. cook. Yeah. Yeah. My wife would be thrilled. Yeah, she, yeah. she would love that, I'm sure. Yeah. So I love your Instagram posts, your Twitter posts, you're super funny. Um, I love that you just recently Instagrammed your mugshot, <laughs> which is amazing. Yeah. Why did you want to post that and like let the world see that? But it's public record, so it's out there, so the world can see it anyway, so it's not like I'm, I'm really breaking any news stories. Uh, I don't know, I woke up in the morning and I just had kind of like that wild hair. I was like, <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna post my mugshot. You only spent the night in the jail, like one night, right? And just had to pay a fine. It was like not a yeah, big I, deal. Yeah, I was there f maybe a few hours. Eight, 18 hours or something like that. So that's not bad. Yeah, it wasn't bad. But I noticed you also Instagram a lot with Timothy, your co-star from Call Me By Your Name. So you guys are pretty close, you hang out a lot. We definitely still talk a lot. We talked this morning. Uh, yeah, yeah, I mean, it's, it's great. You know, I mean, that's, that's one of the fun things about this job is you get to work with so many so many great, fun people. Uh, you know, I, on this one, I got to work with Jeffrey Rush, and we still email and talk to each other. And, you know, uh, it, it, that's one of the perks of the job is getting to work with great people and then moving on and then going to work with other great people. Yeah, the young Hollywood fans, like, love that you guys are friends and that you hang out. Is there anything, like, embarrassing or anything, like, weird about him that he wouldn't normally tell everybody that I he really... I would love nothing <laughs> more than to just totally spill the tin teeth. I just, I can't, can't do it. 